Okay, I'm back from rinsing and deep conditioning, and I wanted to try a new product that I've had, um, but I haven't really used it, and it's, it's by Cantu, Argan Oil Leave-In Conditioner and Repair Cream. Um, Uh-oh, sorry you guys, it's, everything's backwards on here. Okay, anyway, so I'm, I'm, I'm putting this in my hair, and oh. I gotta tell you, <laughs> it feels waxy, which is the reason why I washed my hair in the first place. Because I, I don't need, I can't explain it. It's oh, I don't like this product. Um, this is not a paid product review. Let me just say that I just picked up some things. Um, that I've done some research on and again, you know when your hair is your hair You have to find what works for your hair. I don't like this. I Don't like it at all. So um, Ooh, look at that I'm not liking that not liking it not liking it. Um, I'm gonna see uh, I really don't want to wash my hair again Although I may have to. See, it feels very, um, it feels hard. Not hard, but uh, like I have to, I have to detangle it again. Oh, yeah, see? You hear that? And I'm starting at the bottom, so. Oh, I don't like this. No. Okay, I tell you what. I'm going to wash this out. And I'll be back, you guys. I'm going to wash this out and go back to what I know. Wow. <laughs> so, <sighs> let me show you. I had to do. Okay. So this is the Live Clean um, hydrating shampoo that uh, I was telling you about. It's kind of wet here. I'm going to drop it on my computer. So I use that to, to wash that stuff, that Cantu product, out of my hair. Um, and then I conditioned reconditioned it with their conditioning um, product. Now, let me tell you, my cuticles on my hair was so open that the water was pouring off my hair as if it was coming from a shower nozzle. And I knew they were too open, like my hair was gonna immediately get dry, like quick. So, um, I decided after I went ahead and washed that conditioner out that I would go ahead and shock my cuticles back into place by using a very cool water. I sectioned my hair into two sections. I put this one up in one big bantu knot and I took this side, I combed it down and I shocked my cuticles shut um, after I you know, detangled it with the comb um, to lock in the moisture. So. When I was doing my hair, it stayed moist for a while, and I did the same thing with this side too. So it's taken me quite some time to get all this done, but I put it back in band two knots because I think my hair looks best curly. Although I look crazy like this, right? I'll be wearing a head wrap, honey, before I go outside looking like this. But anyway, and I skipped a spot here, but I can kind of fluff it and fill it in. <coughs> Excuse me, once it dries. So, um, that's what I had to do. And then I went ahead with their um, their leave-in conditioner, which is also all organic, certified organic. Uh, after I got my hair, I used my butter. Let me just say that. Uh, when I sectioned my hair off, I, I put um, my butter that I made, my Shantu coconut oil, olive oil, and cinnamon oil. Um, I took about a teaspoon. Uh-oh. Took about a teaspoon of that, put it in a little dish, and then I took three drops of my patchouli, 
oil uh, and mixed it in with it to, just to give it a good fragrance. Um, mixed it in with the spoon and then I just went ahead and, and um, tried to seal, keep my cuticle sealed shut with the uh, shea, shea butter. So after I sprayed on the leave-in, I'm just putting this on just to warm my head up a bit so that the oils can melt into my hair and help keep the moisture in. I know that the only problem that I will probably have at this point will be very close to the roots and that's because I don't put the shea butter on my scalp. It's too heavy and it'll clog my uh, hair follicles, right? It'll keep your hair from coming through like it's supposed to. I don't want that to happen. So what I usually do with my scalp is I, um, I'll refresh it with some peppermint oil uh, mixed with olive oil and uh, or spearmint oil, something like that. A very mild mixture just to refresh my scalp and rejuvenate it, but I probably won't do that till a little bit later on. So anyway, that's a wrap for today. Wow, thanks for coming on this adventure with me. Uh, for those of you who have been following me since the beginning, I really, really appreciate it. Thank you very much for hanging in there with me. I don't know what I'm doing. I think I gave you that disclaimer in my first video when I talked about the green hair, right? So, um, I don't know what I'm doing, but it is a journey. I'm trying to learn my hair because I still do have the different, the two different textures on my head. And it's, it's very difficult to deal with it when it's like this because your uh, unprocessed hair doesn't like always the same care that you give hair that's processed. So there you go. Thanks for coming along. I will see you guys next time. Have a good week.